Hello, it's me. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. And I just was thinking as of what, what the days that are coming on this, this Wednesday, and uh, some words came to me. Uh, this person once said, almost anything will work again if you unplug it for a few minutes, including you. You know, that, those are interesting words. And if you really want to, to uh, think of it, you know, if you want to reflect upon it, maybe you've gone on a, a retreat and uh, you came, you know, maybe here in our parish, you can ask our men of the parish who went on retreat just recently, uh, two weeks ago, and ask them how they felt. Many of them just, uh, for, for some, was probably the first time they've been away, a retreat from Friday to Sunday, but what a difference they felt it made in their lives. And maybe that's what that somebody meant, you know, that sense of unplugging. But I don't want to look far ahead, but, you know, believe it or not, uh, in a week, actually next Wednesday, is Ash Wednesday, the beginning of our season of Lent. And I, I would say, I, I probably, I really would suggest that uh, what a great opportunity for that annual retreat. When you look at it, the church gives us that opportunity for an annual retreat to really open our lives to the Lord who saved us so that by the time Easter comes around, the, the cel celebration of the resurrection of the Lord, we are uh, renewed and ready to rise with the Lord and walk again as you know the children of God that we are, the baptized children of God that we are. But yes... I would say maybe think of these days before next Wednesday, Ash Wednesday, how, you know, reflect and pray. What in your life maybe is, uh, needs a little unplugging? What aspect of your life needs that uh, Lenten unplugging so that you can plug it in again? And you know what? Perhaps it's opening our lives to the Lord so that he does the unplugging and plugging again, plugging back into his power. You know, he is the vine, we are the branches, and sometimes we, 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 we lose out, even though we are connected to him, because he never, he never leaves us, and we are, because of uh, the virtue of baptism, we are always connected somehow. But I think sometimes our lives and our choices, everyday choices, many times contrary to the will of God, they, un they take us away from that source. And sometimes we need to, a little unplugging and plug in to just refill anew the power, the strength, the love, the consolation of that God. So yeah, I think we look forward to Ash Wednesday. And maybe this week, pray, reflect, and see what, what is the aspect of your life will need that, the Lord, to, to recharge you, so to say, to that little unplugging so that you can be plugged in again in the life of our Lord. My brothers and sisters, love because you are loved. Amen.